animals of Africa list two. First one, zebra. Zebra is an animal, and we know zebra has black and white stripes. Yes, and it is a wild animal which loves to eat plants. Yes. So the sentence is a zebra has stripes on its body. A zebra has stripes on its body. To the next word, lion, and we know lion is an animal. Yes, and he is called the king of the jungle. We call lion the king of the jungle. So the sentence which we have called is a lion is the king of the jungle. It is also an Animal. We go on to the next one. Want something? What do you desire? Can you see this child? He wants to eat an ice cream. He has something on his plate, but he loves to eat an ice cream. So the sentence which is here is, I want to eat an ice cream. Shy. Shy is somebody who is not comfortable in doing something. Some of them may not be comfortable in dancing. Some may not be comfortable in singing. So they are shy. They go back a little step for back. So. The sentence is Tom is a shy boy. Tom is a shy boy. Main is the hair on the face of the lion, basically. So can you see the hair on the face of the lion? It is called mane. So what is the sentence? A lion has mane. Bush. Bush is a plant which has many many stems. Yes, and it is small. It is called a bush. So a rose bush has Many thorns. A rose bush has many thorns. Can you see the picture where the rose plant? There are many rose plants together, and they are very close to each other and very dense. That is called bush. Fruit. Now, what is a fruit? Fruit is a part of a plant and which has seeds in it. And we should eat a fruit every day to stay healthy. So the word is sentences. We should. Eat a fruit every day. Yes, any one fruit, whichever you like, you should be eating. Now moving on to the next one. Next one, grass. Grass is also a type of a plant, and it is basically grown in the ground. And it is what color? Green in color. So the sentence is: The grass is green in color. The grass is green in color. Spot. Spot means can you see that small small circles on the leopard's body? That is called spots. Now the leopard has spots on their body. Leopards have spots on their body. Now the next one is the next one is grey. Grey is a color. Now can you see the elephant? It is grey in color. So the elephants basically are grey in color. So the sentence is elephants are grey in color. Yes, children. So you have understood the meaning of these words. Please try to read it, and I'm and I'm sure you all know that these words are to be read as whole words, and we should not break them up and read.